Four point five, Travis Tritt, and take it easy on a weird food Wednesday. I'm Bill Michaels, Paul Hayden, just popping into the studio this morning. Mr. Hayden, how are you? Good, good. How you doing? Doing pretty good. So today, Paul, we have gone to Cup of Noodles once again. All right, it's a uh, Cup of Noodles Campfire S'mores. Okay, no campfire necessary. <laughs> you can enjoy the satisfaction of s'mores anytime, anywhere with cup noodles, campfire s'mores by simply adding water, microwaving for three minutes, and letting it stand for two minutes for for indulging. No smoke in your eyes. No smoke in your eyes. Saucy s'mores ramen ball. <laughs> okay. All right. Pass one over to me. These have not been stirred up, by the way. All right. All right. So keep that in mind. Pull off the lid and. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Paul. Good and noodly, too. Good and noodly. Mine's in a big blob. Yeah, mine, too. Oh, mercy. All right. <laughs> there were, at one point, marshmallows in here. Okay. They melted into oblivion. I see what appears to be chocolate. Okay. Yeah, the whole thing looks kind of saucy. So, we're eating the s'mores campfire or campfire s'mores ramen noodles this morning. You can definitely taste the sugar. <laughs> well, that's good. Yeah, these are available at Walmart. I picked them up a few weeks ago. Apparently, they're still available, but I couldn't find them. I went back a second time looking for more. Probably sold out. Yeah, I'm seeing them on eBay, three for 15 bucks. Really? Oh. Now you know where they went. Mm-hmm. I see what you mean by you can taste the sugar. Mm-hmm. And that's about it. Yeah. I cannot... I cannot Pick out a, a definite flavor anywhere else in there. Maybe you should taste s'mores. <laughs> I guess you already did the dad joke in the day, right? Oh, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. It doesn't taste like s'mores. It just kind of tastes like sweet noodles. Sweet noodles. I mean, but it's good, though. Yeah, I mean, how can you go wrong with it's just sweet noodles? Really? Really? Yeah. Yeah. So, limited edition. I think there'll be a really limited edition campfire s'mores with natural uh -huh. and artificial flavors. There you go. What is the natural flavor in there, Paul? <laughs> what is it? I don't know. <laughs> natural sugars. Maybe it's a styrofoam. The natural taste of styrofoam <laughs> containers. A couple of little campfire s'mores. Other than the fact that it tastes sweet. Only 400 calories and 61 grams of carbs. How much sodium is in this, Paul? Make you big and strong. I don't want to know. 800 nope. milligrams of sodium. I don't know. I can feel my ankles swelling up right now, though. So this has got to be a lot. No kidding. If you peed outside right now, you'd kill the grass. <laughs> oh, man, Paul. How are we doing on the roads? <laughs> well, traffic had been getting by on the left shoulder only. That earlier vehicle fire is out. It was a tractor trailer tire fire south of 95 in Triangle at the 148. Thank in Stafford County. Oh, yeah. <laughs> enjoy it. In Stafford County, the crash is Trustlow Road and Carriage Hill Drive with authorities on the scene. And there was a dump truck crash on Mountain View Road between Knowles Lane and Guy Lane. Authorities had Mountain View Road completely shut down. Northbound 95 has a moderate volume near Quantico. And again, at Newington, the crash in Springfield at the 170 on the right shoulder. You'll slow at the Pentagon Northbound 395 was left in an earlier crash at the 9.4. It's over on the right side. I'm Paul Hayden with traffic. And Paulie, these ramen noodles, man, they are pretty good, but they're syrupy sweet. Yeah, they are. Oh, man. What do you expect? Yeah, well, exactly. <laughs> traffic update brought to you by NK Floors, making your vision a reality with next level precision flooring, quality and integrity with over 20 years of experience. NKFloors.com. Got any chopsticks over there? No, I don't, man. No. I'm still trying to twirl <laughs> one piece. It's like one giant noodle in there. It's good, though. I like mine like that. You know what? 800 milligrams of sodium. What is shocking to me? Wow. You can't taste the sodium. You yeah, you really can't. The, the sugar is killing it. It is. a kill it. And it's not a chocolate flavor, not a marshmallow flavor. It's just a sugar mm -hmm. flavor. It's good, though. I like it. I think I'll finish yeah. it anyway. <laughs> Polly, thank you for checking in <laughs> on a Weird Food Wednesday. You're going to give it thumbs up, thumbs down, or? Uh, I'll give it a, yeah, thumbs up. Why not? Oh, dude, I'm if, giving it a thumbs down. I really, I mean, if you like noodles, I think you'll like it. Yeah, I was hoping to have at least a, a hint of chocolate in yeah, there. Yeah, maybe I'll sprinkle some marshmallows on top. There you go. All right, my <laughs> friend, have a great day. and Enjoy your, your ramen noodles. Thanks for breakfast. <laughs> I don't uh, know. I yeah. You like it? I think it's it, all right. It's sweet. Yeah. It Definitely doesn't look sweet. anything like a s'more. I it's, didn't. It's like they took a cup of brown sugar and just dumped it in there. That's pretty much it. I mean, the kids yeah. will love it because it's incredibly sweet, and I've got a big mm -hmm. sweet tooth. But, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, don't know. I yeah. definitely wouldn't pay three for fifteen on eBay. Wherever you sell that, pay fifteen yeah. cents for it next time. <laughs>
It's Weird Food Wednesday and our s'mores flavored ramen noodles. Oh my goodness, Paul Hayden. 